Good evening. Campaigners hoping to revive Manston Airport say they're disappointed an application to reopen the site as an air freight hub has been criticised by the planning inspectorate. It emerged today that River Oak's strategic partners have been told their plans are insufficient and inadequate, as Leanne Rinney reports. How to use this former airport site is a decision that's caused controversy ever since it closed four years ago. And today, local residents who want to see it redeveloped for housing, businesses and heritage have welcomed fresh criticism of plans to reopen it as an airport. I'm very delighted that the planning inspectorate are highlighting these issues because they are crucial issues um, to be able to get right from the very beginning. And if they haven't done their homework and they're not answering questions from the public in their consultations about the impact that it does have on us, then I can't see how it could possibly go ahead. The government agency responsible for planning applications found a number of flaws in the documents put forward by River Oak strategic partners to create an air freight hub including flaws in the noise assessment, environmental impact survey and funding strategy. In the grand scheme of the four years it's taken and the £479 million they expect to spend, this is just a little bit more money to the lawyers, a couple of weeks and it'll all be sorted. In a statement today, River Oak said they had an extremely positive meeting with the planning inspectorate yesterday and said they will now be putting together all of the information required over the next couple of weeks before they resubmit their application. So for now, it seems the future of Manston Airport still remains uncertain. Leanne Rinney, BBC South East Today in Ramsgate.